Hello, and thank you for running our Dodge Caravan wheelchair accessible van. We made this video just to show you how to use the van and the handicap features. Uh, it's very easy to use, so this will be just a very quick video just to familiarize with you with how to use the vehicle. Um, so this van has a, a wheelchair ramp, uh, ramp that comes down, and you can operate that from the remote. So if you see on the remote, these two bottom buttons has uh, the door times two, which means that you press it twice. So the ramp is on the passenger side and to operate the ramp and that door on the remote, you press the uh, right hand side twice. So one, two, you'll see the door opens right up. The ramp will come down. and the vehicle will actually lower so that it makes it easier to get the wheelchair into the van. Next, I'm gonna show you how to take the uh, front seat in and out, depending on where you wanna put your wheelchair passenger. Okay, and this wheelchair van has, uh, there's two places where you can have a wheelchair passenger. One is in the front seat and one is in the back in this empty space here. The front seat is actually removable. So you can take the front seat in and out depending on where you want to put your wheelchair passenger. Uh, the way to remove the seat, if it hasn't been already, is to press on the right hand um, pedal here, which will then lift the seat up and out of the grooves. And then you just pull it back. Once the seat's removed, your wheelchair passenger can sit right up front in the passenger seat. To put the seat back, should you need to do that, you align the seat with the rails, and you can see there are, are connections to the rails there. And once you have them inside the rails, you press on the, it's kind of the, the inverse procedure. You step on the thing, on the pedal, and it snaps into place. Make sure you give it a good tug to make sure that it is in fact secured in the position. Um, Next, I'm going to show you how to uh, put the wheelchair passenger and secure them inside the van. Okay, as I mentioned, you can, the wheelchair passenger can go into the, either the front passenger side or in the back in this open space. You can actually have two wheelchair passengers at once, one in the front, one in the back. So right now I'm gonna show you how to attach or how to secure the passenger in both. So in this configuration, the uh, front seat has been removed and the wheelchair passenger is going to sit up front. So you simply put the wheelchair in the position. There are four steps to this process. First step is, first step is to make sure that the wheelchair wheels are secured with the brake that they come with. That way the wheelchair won't move. The second step is to secure the wheelchair with one of these grappling hooks in the back. This is a, a self-retracting hook that once you connect it, it's connected and it's tight. You don't have to worry about it. The way to release it is this little red button here. You press and hold that red button and then pull it to, to, to release some slack. So step two is to release, is to connect it from the rear. And step three is to release, is to uh, connect it from the front. So that way the chair will not move forward and it will not move backward. So now that I have it connected, it will not move forward because this will stop it. I also connected it to the frame of the wheelchair, which is important. You don't want to connect it to a wheel or something that's movable because it won't be as secure. Step three, there is a, if you come in here, there's another grappling hook or whatever the term is for these things. Up front here, same thing. You just secure it to the frame and then it is it's stable and it won't, it will, it will keep the wheelchair from moving back or tilting back, which is also something that can happen if you don't use it. So it's important to use both of these things. And then finally, step four is to buckle the passenger in. The seatbelt buckle is back here and the seat belt itself is in the place where you would normally expect it. You simply put the seat belt over the person and buckle it like so. Four steps, 
secured passenger. Next, I'm gonna show you how to secure this wheelchair or a second wheelchair into this position. Okay, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to secure the wheelchair in this rear configuration. So, um, similar, it's actually the same four steps. So step one is to secure the brake on the wheelchair itself. Step two is to secure it from a rear position, which any one of these two grappling hooks can do. That will secure it, it will not move forward from there. Step three is to secure it from the forward position, which I've done like so. And then finally, step four is to put the seatbelt on the person. So in this last video, I used this seatbelt buckle for the front seat, but actually there are two seatbelt buckles in here. So when you have two passenger in, two passengers, make sure that the rear passenger uses this buckle and the front passenger uses this buckle. But in this case, here's the seat belt for this passenger. Comes across them like so, and they're all set and ready to go. Thank you. And finally, once your passenger is either loaded into or, rem or removed from the van, the way to put the, seat, uh, the ramp back up is exactly the same way that you got it down in the first place. On the, on the remote, the right hand side button, lower left, times two, press it twice, and like magic, it will go back to its original position. Like I said, very simple to use. If you have any questions, please feel, please feel free to reach out to me, and I hope you enjoy using the van. Thank you.